Assalamu alaikum. In this video, we are going to see how to set the material in ANSYS. So, first we have to drag the any analysis system. I, I drag the static structure analysis system. You have to double click on the engineering data or right click on the engineering data and click edit. After select edit, we have the appearance of new dialog box. Inside the dialog box, we have a large number of material types. After that, we have to select a engineering data resources. So, select a engineering data sources. Now, the large number of material types is appearance here. You can select a general material or non general material, explicit material, hyper plastic material, composite material, thermal material, etc. I have double click on the engineering materials such as general materials. After selecting a general material, we have appearance of large number of type of material here such as aluminium alloy, concrete, copper, grey cast iron, magnesium alloy, stainless steel etc. You can also double click on the some of the material types such as general non-linear material. After double click on the general non-linear material, there is a appearance of various type of material here. Concrete NL, copper alloy NL, structural steel NL, titanium alloy NL, etc. Likewise, you can also just select a plus symbol for adding the material to library. Just select a plus symbol based upon your requirement. After adding the material to library, you can utilize in during the analysis. After adding the material to library, you have to just click a return to project. Now the engineering data, you can set a material as per your requirement. To get the regular updates of my video, please subscribe in my channel.